The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has this morning decided to award the 2022 Nobel Prize in Physics in equal share to Alain Aspin, Université Paris-Saclay, and École Polytechnique Palaiso, France. John F. Clauser, J. F. Clauser and Associates, Walnut Creek, California, USA. And to Anton Seilinger, University of Vienna, they received the prize for experiments with entangled photons, establishing the violation of Bell inequalities and pioneering quantum information science. Thank you. So quantum information science is a vibrant and rapidly developing field. It has broad and potential implications in areas such as secure information transfer, quantum computing, and sensing technology. Its origin can be traced to that on quantum, quantum mechanics. Its predictions have opened doors to another world, and it has also shaken the very foundations of how we interpret measurements. What today is considered logical, measurable, and quantifiable was initially debated by Niels Bohr and Albert Einstein in philosophical terms. Clauser, who said, ah, let's do, let's do uh, Bell's experiment. Let's perform it in the lab. Perhaps quantum mechanics isn't right in that situation. Now, that was easy to say, not so easy to do, because with the existing lab equipment, you couldn't, you couldn't perform that experiment. But with collaborators, he came up with a variation of the experiment that could be performed, and he and the late Stuart Friedman went to the lab, they did, they did it, and they found that quantum mechanics works also in this case. Anton Seilinger. So to understand this, you have to know that the goal of a quantum mechanics today is to build a quantum network. What is that? A quantum network is a series of nodes, and these nodes should be able to communicate via quantum entanglement. In these nodes, you can have quantum devices like encryption devices. Yes. Uh, good morning, Professor Seiling, and uh, uh, please ac accept our warmest congratulations to receiving the Nobel Prize in Physics. Thank you very much. It was very kind to receive your phone call just about an hour ago. And I'm still uh, kind of shocked, but it's a very positive shock. Thank you very much. So were you surprised to get the call? Yes, I was actually very surprised to get the call. Thank you. Yeah. 